feels like you're getting a little tap on the back of your head. Feels like a small knocking sensation. Um, it's not painful. Everyone cares about their memory, and we study how it works with the hope of trying to make it work better, and people who have memory impairments due to conditions like brain damage and Alzheimer's disease and other similar sorts of problems. In the primary experiment, there were 16 individuals who we tested. The majority of people in the study did show an improvement in memory. So we used their MRI to identify this memory-related network of brain regions. And we also test their memory at baseline. That is, we see, we see how many things can you remember over a period of time. These are the cards that we use uh, when we test subjects' memories. So we just show them a face. And then we say a common word, town. And then after we um, show them every picture and say the word, Play. we then just show them the picture again and ask them to repeat back the word to us. The person comes into the laboratory every day for about 20 minutes, and they get uh, what's called high-frequency repetitive transcranial magnetic stimulation, where it's this magnetic